So as we said, we're not going to cover everything on this desk because there's way, way too much to cover. So we're just going to have a quick whistle-stop tour of the main features you'll be using day to day. So the first thing is the meter bridge up here. So we've got three different meters on here. The first one, program one, is, is always monitoring station output. We'll come on to the programs in a second, but program one, PGM one, is, is always used for station output. So this meter is always showing you what's being broadcast. And then this one here, program two, is showing us what's on the um, program two bus, which is normally used for recording. So that's the same as the audition bus on the S2 or the record bus on the SRM. And usually we use program two for recording into Myriad or whatever other devices you want to. And then the monitor one here actually follows what's selected in the monitor section, which we'll come on to later. So just keep in mind, that one's what's, your, what's being broadcast, that's what's being recorded, and that's whatever you want to be monitoring. The final part of the meter bridge is the clock and timer section. So you have a clock with a date and time on it, and a time section which can be used for time critical events in your show, such as timing the news. Um, to start the time, you push the uh, run stop button on the event timer, which starts counting up um, in seconds, and you can stop it and you can reset it. The monitor meter can also be switched to other things, so you can use the meter button here to switch between program three, program four, monitor, so you can toggle between those um, three things. Although normally we would leave it on the monitor set um, option so that it can follow what you have down here. 